Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are about to cook up this video here where Tyrese and DJ Envy get into a back and forth in reference to Tyrese calling DJ Envy's wife out of her name. He was, he, he, was, he was on the psych meds then. Because you, you, you said you don't even so remember a lot of the stuff you were saying. Though. I don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't at all. Yeah. So to, just like <clears throat> when you get drunk, do you hold your boy to what he's saying while he's drunk? I'm going to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I hold my boy to what he says while he's drunk because the old saying is a drunk man speaks a sober mind. No, I never held that against you. Okay. Do you hold anybody to anything that they're doing when you know that this is their usual self? They were drunk. They were out of their mind. And they end up saying and doing some shit that hurt my feelings, that was offensive, that made me feel a way. But I know that characteristically, that's not who this man is. To be honest with you, Tyrese, if you're over 21 years old, I am going to hold you accountable for anything that comes out of your mouth. Well, yeah, see, see the, the difference is, I don't, I, I honestly don't know what psych meds you, you were on or who you, you were during know, that point. I don't, I don't know. It. I don't know. I don't, it's I don't know. It's called Rick It fucked I, me I up. don't know. I never had a conversation with you because I never wanted to see you like that. The person who spoke to me on these texts, spoke to my wife during that time at the text, I didn't like that. You know what? What I do like about DJ Envy is this. A lot of people will call DJ Envy a simp. Because of what him and his wife went through publicly, he said, I think something in the book where she said that he, she was faking her orgasms. And look, after 20 years of being with somebody and the same person, you're going to fake something somewhere. So I'm not mad at that. But I like DJ Envy because in all of the cases that I personally have seen with him and his wife, he comes to the defense of his wife. Uh, when others are wrong and DJ Envy, I don't know how tall he is, but he's a little guy. But, you know, it looks like he has the heart of a lion when it comes to his family and his wife. And when it comes to being a man, you got to respect it. And I wanted to remember Tyrese as a person that was my brother and helped my relationship, not the Tyrese that I was going through. So I took a step back from so you, you got until we had a conversation. Messages of the psych med Tyrese? He did. That oh, was you work. crazy? Charlamagne told you to suck his dick before on, on that message. Whoa, hold on for a minute. Charlamagne told you to SMD on that message. And you, obviously it's something that he... Look, I'm going to believe he was on psych meds because if a man says that to you, and you don't remember that a man said that to you, then yeah, there's something going on in your head. Because you was talking crazy. Whoa, whoa. You know that. We hey, had this conversation already. Guys. But he I, said, he literally I, said, I don't, I don't, he said, I, I don't I, remember any of that. But, 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 I don't but, remember what I said that I made you say that but, but or to this made point, you but, feel that way. But to this point, I stuck, uh, took a step back because I didn't know what you were going through. And I tried to talk to you and, and I seen who you were. And I didn't even like who you were online. And to my point, I tried. And when I seen how you were talking this way, I said, I'm going to take a step back. And you know, when, I, when me and Tyrese convenient. had a convenient. How convenient? Yeah, how convenient. Yeah, when, when the way you were talking, the way that you were. How convenient how to step back. What you mean? I never stepped back from you. From you. That was a great answer. I like that answer from Tyrese. How convenient to step back. In this moment, this is the moment you step up. DJ Envy, from what I see, he's mainly the guy that likes to confront people on the radio station, at the radio station. What Tyrese is saying is, listen, why step back in our real life, right, where we text, call, and then in this moment on the radio, you step up and you're so bold. I mean, that's true. You know, me personally, I believe that when situations like this come up, especially if it's with friends or former friends, someone you had a relationship with, I personally believe in handling these situations behind closed doors. It's right. You should have But I never up. talked to your wife in a disrespectful manner. And you talked to mine in a disrespectful manner. Oh. And I never told nobody that. If even I, uh, even even when you were on, you could say you were on those psych meds and you could say that you weren't. You but as a man, some of the things that you said, Tyrese, deserve me to box your mouth. Whoa, did he just say deserve me to box your mouth? Pause. Okay. Box his mouth. One piece, two piece, jab, left hook, Terrence Crawford, Errol Spence. Box your mouth. Punch you out. Lights everywhere. Listen, DJ Envy is standing up for his wife right now. Once again, hey, he's doing that at the radio station. He's behind the chair. He should have really literally got up and just boxed his mouth 
if he disrespected your wife to that degree or in that manner. But he's handling it more like a man. I can respect it. Let's have a, a, a conversation. Let's talk about it. Let me get my feelings out. You get your feelings out. And then let's come to a, a solution that's, you know, not violent and, and, and not a bunch of screaming and hollering. So I, I definitely respect DJ Envy's point of view. But, you know, when a man speaks to your wife um, in a disrespectful manner, you handle that. And you handle that immediately. You don't wait like DJ MV years later, months later, whatever, and then we're on the radio now and approach you. But I can imagine he was boiling on the inside. But seriously, that's some shit you nip in the bud immediately. Well, and I didn't. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, we were talking because this is something that I never wanted to say. And since he wants to be, well, why, MV? I'm telling him why. You said disrespectful shit to my wife. What do you say? It's neither here nor there. To the point where... Why my wife doesn't call you back anymore. And to the point, when you started talking to psych meds, I, me and my wife had a conversation. He said, well, maybe Tyrese was on those medicines when he said. I think everyone remembers when Tyrese was on those meds, right? He was on the meds. He was going through um, a child support situation with his, his wife at the moment. Where, well, his ex-wife at the moment, where she was running his ass through the ringer through the court system and she had came up or the courts had came up with a conclusion to pay her shit i forgot how much it was but it was an outstanding um amount of money and in case you forget the time that that was let me remind you don't take my baby i'm at thirteen thousand dollars a month what more do you want from me <laughs> That was the time when Tyrese was blaming Will Smith, blaming, I mean, I believe him. He was on meds because he said some things about quite a few people that we was like, what? Huh? That's when he was beefing with The Rock and, you know, people had to step in. He was going through a lot. So I, I believe what Tyrese is saying is true. But if you ever text me and my wife... You can't text me because I block, I just unblocked you probably about a month ago when me and Charlamagne was talking and he told me that you were on the psych meds and this is what it was. That's why I'm, yeah, that's yeah. what made me unblock you. So that was the reason why I stopped talking to you and will not reach out to you anymore because I'm like, I don't want to remember my brother as that. Mm -hmm. And maybe you were going through problems. So if somebody talks to, if I talk maybe. to your wife, if I talk to your I wife was. disrespectful, I don't expect for you to come check on me. Okay. And that's how I felt at that time. That's what a lot of people don't tell. But maybe y'all okay. should have been had this wait, conversation. Wait. No, 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 listen. This listen. is great. We have anyone God wants us to have. It. That's it. And, and I'm going to say this, because this is not the first time I've said this. The things that I said and did, the people that I rubbed the wrong way, the things that I posted, my conduct overall that was literally out of my control. I've literally prayed that people can find it in their heart to not hold me to something that I said and did while I was literally out of my mind. I like Tyrese. I like how he handled that situation. I like the fact that he spoke very calm, even after a few things were said, lashed out at him in a disrespectful manner. When 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 DJ Envy was like, well, Charlemagne even said, told you to SMD. That was a shot. And then when he said, I should, I, it made me want to box your mouth. That was a shot. And I think we all can see here, obviously, that Tyrese would pound the shit out of little old DJ Envy. So Tyrese was willing to sit there and take the criticism, listen to it, and improve himself. You got to respect a man like this who can come face to face and say, listen, I'm sorry, my fault, my bad. He really was, look, I don't know, I wasn't there when he took the meds, but it, I think we all remember there was a time when Tyrese was going crazy, okay? Um, big shout to them for sitting down, putting this together, making sure that the brothers came to some type of an agreement. I like to see when the brothers come to an agreement without violence. Big shout to Tyrese, big shout to DJ Envy, big shout to, um, to Charlemagne the God, Big shout to Jess Hilarious. We cooking, baby. We cooking. I'm gone.